Huawei is once again making headlines, and this time it's about three newly certified smartphones. Reports suggest that these devices could belong to the upcoming Huawei Mate 80 series, but there's still some confusion in the air. What we do know for sure is that they are certified with super fast 100 watt charging, which instantly makes them stand out. Let's break down all the details that are currently available. According to fresh information, Huawei has certified three smartphones with model numbers V, Y, G, A, L, O, O, S, G, T, A, L, O, O, and S, G, T, A, L, 50. Among these, one model supports 66 watt wired charging, while the other to step things up with blazing 100 watt wired charging. This is a huge deal because charging speed has become one of the key selling points for flagship smartphones. With 100 watt charging, users can expect their phones to power up in a matter of minutes rather than hours, giving Huawei an advantage in the premium smartphone segment. Now, here's where things get interesting. This certification didn't mention the names of the devices, and this has sparked a debate online. Many believe that these three phones are part of the upcoming Mate 80 lineup. Huawei's Mate series has always been the company's most advanced flagship family, focusing on high performance, powerful cameras, and premium design. So naturally, it makes sense that such high-end charging capabilities would appear in the Mate 80 series, but not everyone agrees. Some netizens and analysts are convinced that these devices don't belong to the Mate 80 family, but instead are part of the Nova 15 series. Their argument is that the Mate 80 lineup traditionally has more than just three models. In fact, the Mate 70 series had multiple versions, including the standard, Pro, Pro Plus, Ultra, and even an Ultimate Design Edition. So how could Huawei only certify three models with 100 watt charging if the Mate 80 family is expected to have at least five variants? One commenter on Weibo said, there can't be only three models in the Mate 80 series. The package is from the Nova 15 series. The Mate 80 series has five models, standard, pro, pro plus, ultra, and ultimate design. This perspective makes sense because Huawei usually aims for a complete flagship package, and three phones alone might not be enough to represent the full Mate 80 lineup. Adding to the confusion, Tipster Digital Chat Station mentioned that one of the certified phones focuses on imaging, featuring Huawei's latest leapfrog imaging technology. Another one is said to highlight the new Kirin 9 series chipset. Both of these features sound like something we would expect in a Mate series flagship rather than a Nova series phone. The Mate series is known for pushing the limits of mobile photography and chipset performance, while the Nova series usually aims at style affordability, and balanced performance. However, timing could also play a role here. Some commentators believe that the Nova 15 series is scheduled to debut in October, while the Mate 80 series might arrive a little later, possibly in November. If that's true, then these three certified models could very well be the Nova 15 lineup that's getting ready for launch. While Huawei is saving its big guns, the Mate 80 family, for a slightly later event, until Huawei officially announces something, we're left with speculation. And that's part of the fun in the smartphone industry trying to figure out the puzzle from certifications, leaks, and tipster reports. But whether these phones are Mate 80 devices or Nova 15 models, the highlight is clear. Huawei is bringing 100 watt charging to more of its devices. And that's a major step forward. Now let's talk about the possible 5 model strategy for the Mate 80 series. If rumors are accurate, Huawei could be introducing a new air version of the Mate 80. This would be a lighter, possibly slimmer version of the flagship, designed to challenge Apple's iPhone Air. Such a move could give Huawei more variety in its lineup, appealing to users who prefer a sleek design without compromising too much on performance. Duh. So where does that leave us? Right now, three Huawei phones are certified with 66 watt and 100 watt charging, but their exact identities remain unclear. They could be part of the Mate 80 lineup, featuring powerful imaging and the new Kirin 9 chip, or they could be Nova 15 models set for an October launch. Either way, Huawei is doubling down on faster charging and advanced technology.
making its upcoming devices worth keeping an eye on dot in the coming weeks. Huawei is expected to clarify things with official announcements. Until then, fans will continue debating whether these are Mate 80 flagships or Nova 15 mid-rangers. But one thing is certain Huawei is getting ready to shake up the market once again with high-speed charging. New chipsets and possibly even a new air model. Stay tuned, because the next few weeks are going to be very interesting for Huawei fans worldwide.